what is this structure by the way structures which are innervating the inferior oblique muscle entering the orbit through the inferior <laughs> thank you thank you so much avinash i hope you people are getting okay so a last easy one the structures that are innervating the inferior oblique muscle one is this and the structure that is passing through the inferior orbital fissure so we know that all are supplied when we will see you in kolkata center very soon um, uh, i hope and you should also pray that everything becomes fine we are also dying to see you and uh, travel let's see <laughs> all are supplied by third nerve except for so4 and lr6 so so4 and lr6 they are not asking so it is supplied by the inferior oblique is supplied by the third nerve so first structure they are telling you uh, they are asking you about the third nerve and you have to tell me this which structure is passing through this inferior orbital fissure tell me guys and what is this what is this this is actually the cavernous sinus cavernous sinus so if you see this is your center hai na so this is structure one this is your internal carotid artery and this one which is uh, it should not be red actually it should be a uh, yellow but yellow will not be visible so i am making it brown theek hai na so this structure is actually your sixth nerve center se internal carotid artery and sixth nerve and then lateral wall se third fourth fifth one fifth two so can you see this is your inferior orbital fissure inferior orbital fissure guys so we have third nerve and we have the second division of the fifth nerve because third nerve supplies the inferior oblique and this is your um fifth nerve which is the f which is actually sub, uh, passing through the inferior orbital fissure so what should be the answer so answer to this question will be your b b and f cavernous sinus is a paired sinus or unpaired sinus is it um, paired or unpaired can you tell me this because lot many times you will have questions related to anatomy and ophthalmology this time you were getting 14 15 questions from ophthalmology so i hope it has been integrated with every subject i have told you also while i was explaining you this questions so you have cavernous sinus thrombosis keratico cavernous fistula you will be requiring all these things so it's a paired sinus it no no it's a paired one it's a paired sinus we have a large transverse sinus between the two cavernous sinus always remember it's a paired one 